वन ऑफ द हिडन जेम्स हियर इन श्रीलंका और बेटर नोन एज द नाइन आर्च ब्रिज कमिंग अप Hello and welcome to another episode of the Sri Lanka Travel Series. If you are new to this channel or do not know me, my name is Alonkar and I run this channel The Globster where I upload a travel video every week including travel vlogs, tips and travel hacks which can help you to bring out the most of your holidays and vacations. So if you like this video, consider subscribing. Today I am here at Ella and I am going to take you to a secret place which not a lot of tourists come and visit. Uh, but before going into that place and before talking more about that, I came from Nuwara Elia to Ella. uh you for for doing that you have to either uh, take a bus or you can also catch a train the train is the best option because the train journey from nuwara elia to ella is considered to be one of the best train journeys in asia and uh, if you have not watched my previous vlog on this that particular train journey i will link that video down in the description below and also put up a card regarding the same so you can go and check that out i am sure you will like it so the place that i am going to take you to right now is called the nine arches bridge Uh, some of you might have heard of it but uh, many of you might have not because i do not find a lot of tourists actually coming to this place most of them go to visit the ravan falls and look at the tea plantations uh, but uh, this is which is why this is called a kind of a hidden gem uh, in ella and uh, uh, there are some absolutely stunning locations to take pictures and also for videography uh, once i reach there i'm going to show you uh, all that excuse me nine arches bridge this way okay We can actually go and have a look. Okay. 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 Fine. Okay. Fine. Bye. So this was a person from another country. I don't know which, but uh, she did not find her way to the uh, Nine Arches Bridge. So let me see if I can. So actually, this Nine Arches Bridge on this bridge, uh, there are uh, a few timings in the uh, in the day, on which the train going from Badulla to another station. I'm not sure of which station, but the train coming from Badulla actually passes through this bridge on particular times of the day, and uh, you must check out those timings before you come here because uh, what people come here to see, apart from the views, is that the train passing. uh by when they are standing on the bridge itself so you can actually stand on the bridge and see the train moving in uh, like passing uh, in front of you and that looks really beautiful so i have the train timings uh, with me because uh, yesterday in the hostel there was a lady from ukraine and i was uh, chatting with her at night and uh, she, uh, by while talking to her and discussing more about this place uh, she actually gave me uh, the list of train timings which i will display on the screen right now so which way are you going this way okay and there is right now there is no one to ask actually in this uh, tea shop also there was no one present palni oh bhai to begin maareda kola din kola abhi aao better age us bare ka hai bidin palni aadi ka kola karenge us bare ka hai palni aadi ka ya This is a slightly unconventional. We have not sure. there's a bridge you see behind me and for going there we have to go through this kind of 
So this kind of small hilly roadway out that you can see other fellow Sri Lankans going from. There are actually four or five different ways, right from starting from the Ella railway station that actually lead to this uh, Nine Arches Bridge. When you, right from the point when you are uh, coming from the Ella railway station, you will be able to see uh, different signboards that are pointing to this Nine Arches Bridge, and uh, they actually lead from different ways down this forest area uh, to get different views of the same bridge. But ultimately, you come and uh, you uh, land at the same location. The bridge. Is, uh, is actually accessible from all of these different ways. I went down there, but from there I could not find a way. Yeah, Here, here. Okay. So I'll go from here. Okay, from here. Even I could not find the way down to the Nine Hunters Bridge from where I was going. So which is why this person actually got a, to uh, gave me a lift. But he has he's saying that I have to go down this way again. So let's see if I can make it to the point faster because the train is due at 9:20 a.m. And it's already 8.30. Now this is a new way that I am going to. I'm not sure. I hope I will get to the right place uh, this time. This is slightly less challenging than the previous one. So I hope this is the right way. This is the problem with secret places, you know. Not a lot of tourists come here, so the ways and all to go is not well defined. You have to make your way through this forest shrubs and slightly risky also. It's not, it's not very safe and clean. Oh, I finally made it. Ah, I can see the track now. I finally reached it. See, this is the track. You see behind me, there's the Nine Nations Bridge. And this is uh, the way the train goes, passing from Badula. So this is the Nine Arches Bridge, which I said is a secret place. Uh, and as you might have found out by my journey over here, <laughs> the way I came. Uh, and this is a beautiful place. Uh, I have seen a lot, lot of pictures on Instagram as well as uh, some, some uh, YouTube videos as well. And I so wish that I had a drone right now because this is those, uh, one of those uh, best locations, you know, to uh, capture some drone footage. The aerial view that you get from the drone, uh, especially in locations like this, it will look uh, stunning. Those kind of aerial footages actually will, uh, would have helped me to add them as a B-roll footage. Uh, B-roll footage is uh, what uh, actually uh, supplements your main footage. For example, right now I am speaking on camera. This is the main vlog that I am doing and the uh, footages that, that you see in between uh, which tell a part of the story are the b-roll footages so i could have made a much more <laughs> better and cinematic vlog if i had a drone so hopefully if my channel does well and if i make more money in future probably i will buy a drone and in future i can make uh, more entertaining uh, uh, videos for you uh, imagine a train passing by from this bridge and that being captured by a drone it's it would look no less than what is shown in uh, movies uh, and this is something I remember from that uh, uh, movie Chennai Express. If you have seen it, uh, you will find that there is a scene 
most probably at the Dutsagar Falls, where uh, they have shot, uh, uh, with, they have kind of an aerial footage of a train passing by and the waterfall behind. So it's absolutely beautiful. And this is a similar location, but without the waterfall. But this is no less beautiful than that. So it is 8.50 right now and the train is supposed to pass from here at 9.20 So right now I'm going to wait for the train to come and when it does I'll try and take some cool videos so that I can club those footages along with this uh, vlog and uh, make it a better one and a more cinematic one So by the way all these images and small clips that I'm taking uh, will be posted on my Facebook page and Instagram page So if you want to you can actually go and follow those pages as well it is 9.18 right now and we can hear the train approaching from that end. There it is. So there you see it, that's what all the people come here to see. It's a wonderful place and when the train passes by, everyone is ready with the cameras or the mobile phones out and uh, to be waiting for the right uh, pictures and uh, videos. So hope you like this video. That's all from the Nine Arches Bridge. Uh, if you like this video, please uh, give it a like and share this with your friends and family. And uh, do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more, more such videos. And when you're doing so, uh, don't forget to press that bell icon on the right. Uh, so that you never miss any updates whenever I post a video on this channel. So I will see you next time. Until then, goodbye.